Hi everyone, welcome to Kitu Blogging and in this video I will show you how you can create a quiz website in Blogger. So as you can see that I have created a quiz section like this in Blogger and this is completely made of HTML, CSS and JavaScript. So it will not ha hamper the page speed of your website and I have created an advanced version of this quiz where you will get a um, countdown timer like this and you can see a report card section at the end of the quiz. So watch the video till the end and you will know how to create a quiz section like this in your blogger website and note that you can use the same code with wordpress or any other cms platform as well so here i am using the blogger platform to demonstrate how this code works so let's start the video so first of all let's check how this quiz section works so whenever i click on this uh, mcq question it will show whether it is right or wrong so let me check what is the capital of france so let me choose the london which is obviously wrong so here as you can see that i have chosen the london and it is saying that paris is the right answer and here we will see the explanation as well at the bottom of the questions so let's select the third answer like what is the largest planet in our solar system so obviously it is jupiter so let me click on here and as you can see that the explanation started showing like this so in this way you can put your questions and mcq answers and you can give a brief explanation about this question as well so it will also improve the seo of your website and it will help you rank your content so make sure to add a proper explanation to the questions as well so as you can see that i have selected like this and it is giving me a report card like this like total question attempted is five out of five there is four correct answer and there is one wrong answer as well and it is giving the percentage of 80 percent so as you can see this is how the simple quiz section works so i will give the download link of this code in the description so you can easily download it for free now let's check the second quiz section so here it is so as you can see that what is 2 plus 2 so let's click on 4 and it's saying that there is a progress bar at the top and that is 20 percent completed and you can see the explanation as well now let's click on the second answer now let's keep select a wrong answer as you can see that and here it is and i will click on here and as you can see that it is giving the report card in a stylish format like total question attempted is five and out of five there is three correct answer two wrong answer and it is giving me a predefined message as well like great job you are doing well so as i have selected three correct answer it is giving me like this so let me just click on reset button here and as you can see that it is reset so let me give wrong answer only here so let's click on give wrong answer and as you can see that is giving a separate message like this script practicing you can improve and let's click on reset and let me select all the right answer from here like this and as you can see that congratulations you got all the answer correct so in this way you can give a personalized message as well in the report card so this is the advanced version and i will release this code to download if this video get 2000 views or at least 50 likes in this video so make sure to hit the like button to get the download link of this code as well so let's check how we can edit this code and add more questions and add a question add the explanation to this quiz as well so for this we are going to log into the blogger dashboard and let me show you in the quiz too so here i have opened this and as you can see that this is the css code as well and here you will see this quiz container and there is this progress bar and here you can see that you can see the question one what is two plus two and you have given four answer four five six seven and we have given an explanation here as well explanation like this so you can change the text here as well and here as you can see that you have to assign the id question one and as you can see all the ids are assigned here as well so in the same way you have to assign unique id to each of the questions so as you can see that there is question two and we have assigned the question here and then we have assigned the answer here as well and make sure to add the ids to the questions so let me add more questions here so what i can do is i can simply copy the last section here and i will paste it here now what i can do is i will change the question 5 to 6 and i will do the same 
with all the answers here as well like this and you have to select the right answer from the options so as you can see that data correct is true that means the first option is true so if you want to select the second option as true then you have to change it to true and you have to change it to false like this so that this one is the right answer so if you user chooses the second option then it will show it as a right answer so make sure to you have to assign this true value to the right option and then you have to change this question 5 to 6 as well now let me just change the question 5 to 6 like this now let me just update this here and let me just refresh this page here as well and as you can see that there is this question number 6 so if I select this one it is giving me the right answer in the option 1 that's because we have selected this data correct true value to the first option so if I select the second option it will giving me the right answer that's because we have set the data correct to true in this second option so if I click on the first option it is giving me the wrong answer so in this way you have to assign a right answer to each of the questions so let me just go to the edit question here and here as you can see you can add the explanation you can change the explanation from here as well so in this way you can add as much questions in this report and let me quickly reset it here and let me select like this and as you can see that the total attempted question is 6 and it is saying congratulations you got all the answer correct but as you can see that I have selected only the 5 answer correct but the 6th answer is wrong but still it is giving the congratulation message so here you have to change the javascript a little bit so here let me scroll down here and here this is the message so if the total question is 6 so let me keep it to 6 and if the correct answer is 6 then only it will show the congratulation message you got all the answer correct so in this way you can change the number of questions value here as well so that it will give the right message in the quiz section so in the same way you have to select the progress bar as well so here it is so you have to set the total questions here so here the total question is 6 um, let's update it so that it will set the progress bar correct so let me just refresh this page and let me select the first question and it is saying 16.67 percentage but earlier it is giving 20 percentage in the value that's because we have set the 5 value in the questions so now it will give the right progress bar like this so you have to change the number of questions in the progress bar and you have to change the number according to the questions in the report card as well so in this way you can add a quiz section to your blogger website and start a quiz website in blogger and note that I will release the second code the quiz 2 code if this video get 2000 views or you have submitted 50 likes and then I will release this code for free so make sure to hit the like button and if you have any doubt regarding this then you can ask me in the comment section and if you want to change any color in this code then you can easily do that by changing the CSS code so you can easily change the CSS code according to your brand like you can see the hover color here and here you can see the wrong answer color to red and correct answer color to green so you can change the color as well so make sure to hit the like button and i will see you in the next one bye bye